I'm Michael Schofield with Dynon Avionics. Here at Oshkosh 2023, we are announcing our Dynon D30 for the Dynon Certified product line. The, the Dynon Certified product line has always encompassed the Skyview HDX displays and a backup flight display. For the past uh, few years since we certified Skyview HDX, that's been the EFIS D10A. The EFIS D10A is one of our most mature products that's been on sale almost continuously for 20 years. People love it. One of them went to space on Spaceship One and on the uh, winning XPRIZE flights. But it's time to, uh, to modernize it. And so what we've done here is we've taken that, uh, what was a three inch platform device, this is a four inch screen, we've modernized it and we're releasing it uh, for now for, on the Dynon certified product line. So what the D30 is, is a backup set of flight instruments for Skyview HDX. It does airspeed, altitude, attitude, vertical speed, slip speed, skid ball, uh, turn rate, and turn coordinator. 30 has a large four inch screen, high resolution, super bright, sunlight readable, uh, twice as bright as the uh, sun setting EFIS D10A. Uh, it's touchscreen and amazingly compact. Uh, whereas the EFIS D10A in its day was a very compact device. Uh, by today's standards, it's not as, as small. The, the D30 is only 3.7 inches deep. There's a backup battery, which in the certified form is required. Um, that gives you at least five hours of runtime if the power would go out. The D30 is designed as a set of backup instruments, and because of that, it's completely standalone. It only requires power, ground, pitot, and static to be connected. And because it's, it's designed as that set of backup flight instruments, there's actually not too much to do. The main thing you would, you would do in flight is adjust the altimeter setting by touching it. There's then a virtual scroll wheel, which adjusts, or if you want to do fine adjustment, you can do that. Just touch anywhere away from uh, that to, to clear it out. There's a menu, but all there really is is to turn the auto brightness on or off or to manually set the brightness. And then of course, uh, with some additional button pushes, this menu has some setup and installation oriented options. The D30 is available now, it's FAA certified. Uh, price is $19.45. In the certified version, there is a backup battery which was required and that is $219. Longtime Dynon fans and customers might be wondering if there's an experimental version of the D30. And the answer is kind of. Right now, because of uh, some limited supply, we're focusing on the certified market. Also, because this was designed as a backup to the certified system, the features that, it ha that I've described here are the complete feature set of the D30. So some other items that people may be familiar with uh, from our other product lines, for example, heading or outside air temperature, won't exist on the D30. So yes, there is an experimental uh, version available, but we want to make sure that uh, customers understand exactly what the D30 can and cannot do. For more information about the Dynon D30, please visit DynonCertified.com.